Welcome back to Grace's room. So Christmas is now around the corner and I'm sure a lot of you guys have been starting to put together your Christmas list. I know James and I have. And sometimes it can be really hard to find things to put on your list since there's so many things to choose from. So thankfully, amazon.com.au has come to the rescue with the help from Kathy Sheeran, who is a shopping expert. And they've put together the top 10 recommended fun toys to help you guys with your Christmas list. The really good thing about Amazon is that it's a one-stop shop and it has a wide range of toys for kids of all ages. And right now we have all of the 10 toys here. And James, what is one of them? The Le Lego Curator set. So this is really cool because it is a three-in-one Lego set and it's like all pirate themed and it's like you can build three different sets in like one set of Lego. <laughs> And I actually love Lego. James and I both love Lego, actually. We love building it, so this will be really fun to build. Okay, so what else do we have? Here is a family board game called Cranium, and basically it has a, a bunch of activities in it. You can like sketch, you can act, you can solve problems and puzzles and lots of other things. And it seems like a really fun game to play because I love board games too. What's this? Oh, no, that. <laughs> this is a Monopoly Mega Edition. So it's basically like the normal Monopoly, but it's actually a bigger version with more money, more houses, more properties, and a bigger board. So it's really fun. Uh, what else do we have? This here is called the Chow Crown, and what you have to do, it's like another family game, and you put a crown on your head and food as well, and you have to try and eat the food as it spins around, and it like plays music, and you have a time limit too. And that one looks like a lot of fun, because I love food. <laughs> What's, okay, what's that one? I want to know what that um, is. This one, a volcano kit. So, I think it's just like a normal volcano kit and it like, it like erupts. Mm -hmm. And I actually remember doing this in primary school. It's so much fun. So I can't wait to do that. Uh, here is a drone and I love drones too. I'm basically saying I love everything because I do. <laughs> Um, it has like a camera in it and it's like, really compact too. So this one seems like a lot of fun. What else is there? Mm, there's walkie talkies. So I've actually never had a pair of walkie talkies. So this is actually really fun too. James and I can use these. <gasps> um, oh, here we have a scooter. And because I'm not the best at riding bikes, I... <laughs> I love riding scooters because they're just easy to ride and it actually looks like a really good scooter too so I can't wait to do this. <laughs> this is a telescope. It comes with like a tripod too so you can like stand it outside your window and stargaze. <laughs> um, this here is, oh the last one we have is the Discovery Kids. I'm actually noticing there's a lot of STEM toys here and I think it's probably because STEM toys are really in at the moment and they're a lot of fun. So this is a microscope. Yeah, it's a microscope. <laughs> and it's good for zooming up on small things. So you can like get a little leaf and put it underneath there and zoom up on it. And they're actually really cool. Okay, so that's all of the 10 toys. What was your favorite one, James? Uh, probably the volcano kit. I think that's probably my favorite one too because I love doing science experiments. I love like chemistry and stuff. So why don't we take a look at this? All right, so we've taken everything out of the box and there are a lot of things that looks like we have to put together here. And you've got the little safety goggles. How cute is that? So I didn't realize we actually have to paint the volcano. So like put like the brown and stuff on it. So it looks like there's a lot of things to put together. So we'll be back once we finish putting everything together, I guess. Okay, where do we start?
so we're ready for an explosion. We've already done most of the setting up. James and I already painted the volcano. We put the bicarb soda and the citric acid in the chamber. And we also put some water and red food coloring in the, I don't know, the tap or the tube. The tube, the tube, that's the word. So we've got our set of instructions here and now all we need to do is put this lid on and also put the volcano, and put the volcano here. Okay. The paint um, pretty much dried. I think it's just a little bit wet some. still. But yeah, what you said. Okay, I'm actually really excited for this. Hopefully it's like a big explosion. Mum will not be happy if it makes a big thing. Okay, so James has got his safety goggles on now and I have to, so this like little, it opens and closes like the tube so the water doesn't go everywhere yet. So I think I just have to go like this. I'm scared, I'm scared. <laughs> oh my God, oh my gosh. No, don't get me. <laughs> oh my God, that was scary. <laughs> okay, maybe it's still fizzing. Come on, come on, go up. Oh my God, look at, look at all the like, bubbles and stuff there. Looks like a ball. Oh, oh wait, wait. Where is it? Where is it? There? Oh, that's better. Now it sounds like a real volcano. <laughs> okay, so I think, I think maybe we should do it again. Okay, where's that? All right, sorry. <laughs> so I think maybe we should do it just one more time because that was pretty fun and I think we can do better than that. <laughs> okay. All right, so we're back for attempt number two. We may have put a little bit more citric acid and bicarb in here and maybe it might cause bigger explosion this time. So we need to put the volcano back on. And oh yeah, I forgot to mention before, James and I have our Apron. Aprons on and I have my scare safety goggles too <laughs> this time and because we're not sure what's going to happen So we just want to be safe and don't want to ruin our tops <laughs> Okay I think that's good. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, let's go. Oh, I need this up this time Whoa! Oh my gosh <laughs> Oh wow that's so one. cool! That's so cute how like, little things are coming. Oh, that's fun. Oh, still splattering. <laughs> the sound effects just make it sound cooler. Has it finished? I think it's finished. Has it? Okay, I think so. Well, that was probably a little bit better than last time. I mean, it was still cool. I think like the little bubbles and stuff coming out looked really cool and like the paint kind of bubbled up too on the side. So everything just looks cool. <laughs> so in this little instruction, okay, I'm gonna take my goggles off. In the little instruction booklet, there's actually a lot of different activities and explosions and experiments you can do. So James and I can't wait to try some of these other ones out. What's this? Okay, now I think we need to clean up because it's a little bit messy. <laughs> Okay, Grace, so apart from the volcano kit, which one's your favorite here? I'm gonna say the chow crown because it looks really fun to play and I'm also a little bit hungry. <laughs> so I can't wait to see what this one's actually gonna be like. So let's open it up. Okay, so it looks like this needs a little bit of assembly and we also need some food, so just give us a couple of minutes and we'll be ready. So James has his crown on, it actually is quite big, um, and he's gonna go first because apparently he's the hungriest. So the aim is to see how many marshmallows he can eat when it spins around and when the music stops. And basically the person who eats the most marshmallows in the end is the winner. So now I need to load James up with his marshmallows. So let's put, oh, let's put them on. Jace is loaded up with his 
marshmallow drink. The powder's getting all over him. Okay, are you ready to start, James? Okay. Wait, I'm going to sneeze. All right. Are you okay? Okay. Come on. than what it looks like, so I'm a little bit nervous. <laughs> okay, so I have my big crown on and I didn't have to bother taking off any of the marshmallows because James did not get any of them. Look, he's a mess, he's got powder all over him. <laughs> okay, now because James didn't do so well, I guess, I'm not sure if I'm gonna do any better, so I'm a little bit nervous, but let's give it a try. but it wouldn't come off the fork. I think it's a little bit sticky. I'm not sure I put, if I put them on the best. So I half ate one of them <laughs> and took a bite of them, but I couldn't really take it off the stick. Well, I think I won because I got one and a half marshmallows, but that was actually really fun. And maybe we can try different food sometime. Well, that was really fun to do. Good job, Kathy Sheeran, for picking out a really good selection of toys that I'm sure kids are really going to enjoy. Amazon's now making it really easy for parents to pick out toys for their kids that they will love this Christmas. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you do check out amazon.com.au because they are a one-stop shop and they have a huge range of toys for kids of all ages. And I'm sure that you're gonna find something there that you love. <laughs> um, so again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. and I will see you next time on Grace's Room. Bye for now. Bye. Play this one next. <laughs>